Brad Shalom. We the brothers of a great millstone of branch out in this morning. First and foremost, we give all praises, honor, glory to Yahweh Bahasham, Yahweh Shai, Bahasham Rachakwadash. Double honors to our apostles and elders of Great Millstone. Peace, blessings, and salutations to all you brothers preaching the gospel and truth and necessary always interior. And a um, quick little in transit, the name of this uh, uh, lesson, Lord Willingness Edifying, is entitled, Whose Side Are You On? You know? Because more and more it's becoming evident who, who, who's the true uh, uh, men that were sent from Yahweh Basham Yahweh Shah, who's the true prophets, who's the true teachers out in the highways and hedges that's, that's prophesying and teaching the downfall of this place and warning our people of what's to come. You know, so this is uh, the book of Exodus, chapter 32 and 26. It says, Then Moses stood in the gate of the camp and said, Who is on Yahweh Basham Yahweh Shah's side? Let him come unto me. And all the sons of Levi gathered themselves together unto him. And, and in the spiritual, because Levi represents Law Yah, which means what? What, what joined to me, man. So all those that's joined to Yahweh Basham Yahweh Shah, hey, 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 you, 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 you know what to do. You know to speak wholesome words. You know to obey the truth. Uh, you know to the best of your ability, man. You know because what did the Lord say about uh, these these the rest of these cats? This is um, book of Second Timothy three and verse thirteen. It says, "But evil men and seducers shall wax worse and worse, deceiving." And being deceived, man. Because these guys ain't speaking according to the word as it is written. Matter of fact, I grabbed that too. This is the book of Isaiah 8 and 20. It says, To the law and to the testimony, if they speak not according to this word, it is because there is no light in them, man. And how do you know if they're speaking according to this word? Well, this is 1 John 4 and 1. It says, Beloved, believe not every spirit. But try the spirits. How do you try the spirit? According to the word, man. It said if they speak not according to this word, it's because there is no light in them. The true prophets are going to come and do what? They're going to preach the, uh, the word precept upon precept, precept upon precept. Here a little, there a little, man. They're going to explain. They're going to go into the words. They're going to teach you and tell you the things was, uh, that's taking place, man. Basically, uh, I have not shunned to declare unto you all the counsel of the Lord. Man, and, made, and made it plain upon tables as it says in Habakkuk the second chapter that it ain't no denying there's no way around it man because the spirit of prophecy is the spirit of Yahweh Shai is the spirit of truth there's no way around the things that the apostles the elders of great millstone are saying the RFID uh, chip is the mark of the beast man that Greek word karagma means what? an incision <laughs> you know karax goes into what? a pale, a palisade Meaning that's the instrument that's, that, that is used to make the incision. It's all there, man. It says, try the spirits, whether they are of the most high, because many false prophets are going out into the world. And those false prophets, they're, no, they're going to do uh, nothing but wax worse and worse as we read. It says, verse 2, hereby know ye the spirit of the most high. Every spirit that confesseth that Yahweh Shah Mashiach has come in the flesh is of the most high. And every spirit that confesses not that Yahweh Shah Mashiach has come in the flesh is not of the Most High. And this is that spirit of anti-Messiah, whereof ye have heard that it shall come, and even now already is it in the world, and it's here now, man. People deny the, uh, the, 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 the miracles that Yahweh Shah did. God saying that the, 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 the mark of the beast is not the RFID chip, it's in Bargoy's philosophy. It's hugging a white woman, giving her a Bible, or so forth and so on, man. 666 men that rule the world That's the 666 All this madness that, that, that's being perpetrated All this madness that's being spewed out of the mouth Of these false prophets man And nobody is saying nothing to these cats Nobody is saying nothing This man said you can You, 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 you can pop your woman in her rectum All kind of madness that's being, that's being spewed man But anything the prophets come out and say Man oh, oh that's ridicule That's spoke against which that's prophecy too. It says that the way of truth shall be evil spoken of, man. It says, blessed are you when men shall revile you and speak evil uh, uh, cons uh, for, for the Lord's namesake, man. Hey, that's a beautiful thing. So we're going to continue to stay strong in the spirit of Yahweh Basham Yahweh Shah, man. May Yahweh Basham Yahweh Shah keep his spirit upon us to continue to push forth his word in righteousness, man, and in truth. It says, verse 4, ye 
are of the most high little children and have overcome them because greater is he that is in you than he that is in the world. They are of the world, therefore speak they of the world, and the world heareth them. We are of the Most High. He that knoweth the Most High heareth us. He that is not of the Most High heareth not us. Hereby know we the spirit of truth and the spirit of error. So whose side are you on, man? Are you on the side of truth or are you on the side of error? Because all men's works are going to be made manifest. You see? Right. And, that, and that's what's happening. You know, so like, mm -hmm. Yeah, the Lord is making that division, man. It says that uh, the Lord uh, came to uh, bring what? To bring division, uh, to, to, to set a man at variance with his own household, man. So he's dividing up the nations, man. All right? He's dividing up the nation, the nation of Israel. All right? Dividing what? The elect, putting the elect on the right side and the, and the, uh, and the, the, the ones that's going to be destroyed on, on, on the left-hand side, man. He's letting it be known who he's dealing with, who his chosen is. As it says in the book of 2nd Ezra, the 16th chapter, says they shall be like mad men, sparing none, going into the time of Jacob's trouble, when martial law breaks out loose, when all hell, all chaos breaks out loose. The Lord is going to be let it, let it be known clear and, and, and uh, uh, make it manifest who he is dealing with. And that process has already begun because you see the wayward doctrines that these other camps is dealing with. Yes, they know that they that that they're uh, they're Israelites. And they may be telling you that you're an Israelite. That's only one step, man. All right. And back in the ancient days, everybody knew they was Israelites. So it goes to be, it goes beyond that. There's way, there's way more steps. All right. There's way more steps on the staircase than just knowing that you're an Israelite. It goes deeper than that, man. All right. And the Lord is looking for the true worshipers to worship Him in spirit and in truth, because it says in that John the fourth chapter that He seeketh such to worship Him as, man. All right. And like Joshua said, He said. Are you going to serve the gods of your fathers that that, that they served in the, in, in Egypt? All right, the, the gods of the Amorites, the god of the Egyptians. All right, but as for me and my house, we going to serve the Lord. The Lord is the, the Lord is making it clear who actually serves the Lord and who uh, uh, doesn't serve the Lord. Who serves their own belly and how he's and how's he doing that? He's doing that through the mouth of his prophets. Luke one and seventy, he spake through the mouth of his prophets. In the book of Romans, it said the Romans the sixteenth chapter says, "Mark them which cause divisions." Contrary to the doctrine, uh, um, contrary to the doctrine, for they serve not our Lord Yahweh Shai Mashiach, but their own belly, man. All right, and it says by uh, uh, by by fair words they deceive the simple, man. So the Lord is showing you who He's dealing with by the mouth of His prophets, man. He's showing you He's dealing with the prophets by how the prophets conduct themselves and how they, because we're the only ones, like you said, this nigga saying all this type of wayward shit and all these false doctrines well who's the one that's getting on them it's the men of great millstone starting with the apostles and the elders that's the sign of the prophets that's the sign of the men of the lord that's the sign of having the spirit of Yahweh by shem yahweh shine upon you all right this is a uh, uh because they because like like the scripture says it says let the blind lead the blind and they both shall fall into the ditch that's why it says that evil men and seducers shall wax worse and worse deceiving and being deceived man so ultimately, if you get caught up into some madness that these guys is pushing, this Proverbs 17 and 4. It says, a wicked doer giveth heed to false lips, and a liar giveth ear to a naughty tongue, man. So ultimately, the, the, the cats and the people that's following these different wayward groups, man, that's preaching false doctrine, it's because these people was wicked within themselves, man. You see? It says, a wicked doer giveth heed to lying lips, man. Right. So that means that the, the, the people that's following uh, their, uh, these false prophets, man, it's because they're wicked too, man. Right, and the Lord sent them what? Strong delusions that they uh, believe a lie that they may be damned, man. That they receive not the love, the love of the truth, man. Ultimately, it's all the Lord's doing, all right? It wasn't meant for all of Israel to get it. It wasn't meant for all of Israel in these times to be saved, man. The book of Matthew, the 24th chapter, says plainly and simply, and simply that Yahweh Shai and the angels is coming back for the elect, for the chosen, all right? And the book of, uh, in the book of um, Sirach, it says that the elect shall praise the Lord's holy name. So that cuts out IUIC right there. <laughs> that is, that's, the, that's a division right there. It says in the Bible, it says that the, uh, that the Lord is only coming for the elect. In the book of Zechariah, the 13th chapter, it says that the, uh, uh, it says that the, he'll bring the one third through the fire and they shall call upon my name and I shall call them my people. So that shows you the ones that the Lord is coming to save is, is, uh, is going to be calling upon his true name and truth and in sincerity. That cuts out IUIC. They say that the name of the Lord doesn't matter. They say you, you can call him your play yogurt. 
They say that we don't have the name. So that's a division right there. All right. The mark of the beast. The, the scriptures say if you if you receive the mark of the beast, you're going to be thrown into the lake of fire. So all these people saying that the mark of the beast doesn't matter or, or saying that it's something that it's not. That shows you more likely they're going to take the chip and that and, and, and that they're not a part of the elect, that they're not a part of the chosen. So the Lord is, 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 is like I said, the Lord is making it more clear who he is dealing with and who he is not dealing with, man. All right. Yep, this is uh, St. John 8 and 43. Why do ye not understand my speech? Even because ye cannot hear my word. Mm -hmm. Ye are of your father, father the, the devil, devil, and the lust of your father ye will do. He was a murderer from the beginning and abode not in the truth. Because there is no truth in him. When he speaketh a lie, he speaketh of his own, for he is a liar and the father of it. And, 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 and these false prophets, man, and two-thirds of our people, they got the same spirit of, 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 of disobedience in them, man. Same as Esau, Edom, the same as Cain. Since the beginning, man, they got the same spirit upon them, man, the spirit of rebellion, the spirit of disobedience. It says, verse 45, And because I tell you the truth, ye believe me not. Which of you convinceth me of sin? And if I say the truth, why do ye not believe me? He that is of the Most High heareth the Most High's words. Ye therefore hear them not, because ye are not of the Most High, man. So whoever, uh, uh, like like we read in 1 John 4, they that hear us, starting with the apostles, the elders of great millstone, you are in the spirit of truth. They that hear us not, you are the spirit of error. Why? Because the word, uh, the word of the Most High is not abiding in you, man. Because you denying that Yahweh Shah came in the flesh. Now you might got a guy that'll say, well, uh, no, I preach Yahweh Shah. The guys like ISUPK, you know, uh, uh, guys like, uh, um, 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 what's the other fucking group? Sakari. Yeah, Sakari. You know what I'm saying? But all these other one groups, body. man. You know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. One body in Yahweh Shah. So they say like, yeah, we 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 teach that Yahweh Shah came in the flesh, but you denying his works, man. How do you how do you how 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 is that? Because you're not sticking to the script. It says what? Rightly dividing the word of truth directly and correctly, man. If you're not rightly dividing the word of truth, then you're denying the power of. That means you're denying the uh, you're denying the Lord. That means that what you're giving a false record, man. You bearing false witness. Because the scripture says that what, man, hey, we should bear a record. We got to believe the record that the Most High left of his son, which is what the scriptures, man. It says we have a more sure word of prophecy. You do well to take heed. There is no private interpretation. So somebody is wrong and somebody is right. And through the spirit of Yahweh Basham, Yahweh Shah, us here at Great Millstone, we believe that we right, man. Because why? Because all the puzzle pieces line up, man. Everything clicks and makes sense, you know, but... This is St. John chapter 10 and verse 25. It says, Yahweh Shai answered them, I told you, and ye believe not. And the works that I do in my father's name, they bear witness of me. But ye believe not, because ye are not of my sheep, as I said unto you. My sheep hear my voice, and I know them, and they follow me. So the Lord's sheep is going to hear his voice. And the one that's not of his sheep, that's not that's, that, that's not of his foe, all right, they not going to get it. All right, they're gonna believe a lie, or they're gonna uh, they're gonna follow the voice of a different shepherd, and that other shepherd is Esau, Edom, and that shepherd is leading them to the fucking slaughterhouse, man. All right, all these all these false teachers, all right, these false Israelite teachers, even these false pastors in the churches, man, they leading you straight to your fucking destruction, man. All right. These pastors not telling you who your enemy is. They telling you to love your fucking enemy, man. These pastors in the churches, all right. Got goddamn uh uh the the dude uh, uh the brother of Bolton hugging his damn enemy, all right. And that shows you, man. That shows you the 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 effeminization of uh uh that that Christianity that Christianity brings, man. Because the the nigga the nigga his own brother died, and you got every, all the all the niggas in the um in the courthouse crying. And, 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 and wishing that she didn't have to go to jail Then the next day Or, the, or, or two days after You got the dude that testified against that uh, uh, Against Amber Geiger she, He gets put to death man So that shows you the mind frame of these so called white people All right? More than likely it was a, it was a, a damn Edomite That put his ass to death man All right, Someone on the police force probably Put his ass to death man Supposedly Right. Motherfucker was coming to box, box. He was a drug, drug dealer. dealer yeah. and, and, That's some uh, bullshit, man. They put a whole lie together, a whole bullshit ass lie together, man. All right. This nigga a witness on a high profile case, and I'm coming to box some, some shit from this nigga. Right, right. 
Uh, but that show you that, that these Edomites, they, they don't give, they don't have no compassion for you niggas, man. All right. They have a perpetual hatred. All right. And they, they, they seeking your downfall while you trying to hug all on all them, man. All right. But that was it on that, John. This is Acts 20 and 26. It says, wherefore, I take you to record this day that I am pure from the blood of all men. And, and us here at Great Millstone, starting with the apostles, we can say that, man. Why? How, why are we clear from the blood of all men? Verse 27. For we have not shunned to declare unto you all the counsel of the heavenly father. Take heed therefore unto yourselves and to all the flock over which the Holy Spirit hath made you overseers to feed the church of the Most High, which he hath purchased with his own blood. For I know this, that after my departing shall grievous wolves enter in among you, not sparing the flock. Also of your own selves shall men arise speaking perverse things to draw away disciples after them. Therefore, watch and remember that by the space of three years, I cease not to warn everyone night and day with tears, man. And it's the same thing with us through the spirit, man. The apostles and elders been out there for how long warning you against uh, false prophets, against all these guys that's, that, that, that's preaching things contrary to the doctrine, man. So, right. so Paul said for three years he warned, man. Hey, 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 uh, uh, us in this time, well, hell, hell away longer than three years, man. Warning you about these different guys, warning you about these different cats, man, to stay mm -hmm. clear from them, you know, and and, and 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 not to follow after their pernicious ways, man. Yeah, and then so when you get caught up in it, that's going to be on your hands, man. We've been blowing the trumpet. Then you got other so-called watchmen not blowing the trumpet. You decided to take, you decided to follow after their example. So the blood is off our hands and the blood is going to be on their hands, man. Like that whole situation that went down with IUIC, all right, the, they... Allegedly, there was a murder committed, all right, and, and then what? Then you had a bunch of people start scattering, right? You got a bunch of people start leaving the uh, IUIC. Well, we already told you that that, that them niggas was wicked. Same why ISU, ISUPK, we already told you. So when these leaders of these different groups hit the back door when all hell breaks out loose, we already told you of it, man. And then you're going to try to come around us and get the oil. Well, it's going to be too late, man. To the death, to the death, to the sword, to the sword, to the famine, to the famine, man. That's all it. right? That's it. Hey, so with that, Lord willing, that was edifying. We give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahasham, Yahweh Shai, Bahasham, Rechakodash. Double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone. Peace, blessings, salutations to all you brothers preaching the gospel in truth and in sincerity, always in charity. Hey, Shalom, brothers. Shalom.